Hello, my name is Gaston Gomez, and I will be talking about Building One Community, which is uh, it's a place that I started, started volunteering about a year ago. Uh, it has been an incredibly rewarding experience. Um, as a tutor, I work with students of all ages, and I work with people from very many different cultures and very many different backgrounds. I've worked with students who speak French uh, from Haiti, and I've worked with students who speak Spanish from all over South America, from Guatemala to El Salvador to Ecuador, Argentina, Paraguay, Uruguay, Chile, and all these different places. And the thing I've learned and the thing that's most impactful to me is the amount of impact I can have on the people that I tutor. Um, when I first started, I was very shy and I was very nervous when I would go into my classes. But as I, as I moved along and I, and I went to more tutoring sessions and I became uh, a more, a more advanced teacher, I found that tutoring became easier and easier. And all of a sudden, I started having a confidence that I, I didn't have at the beginning. And it was a confidence in, in not only English and, and teaching them, but it was also a confidence in the language I was teaching. When I first started, for example, I, I would have to use Google Translate a lot of the time to find the definition of uh, words to translate from Spanish to English and vice versa. But as I practiced more and as I went several times a week, I found that I would have to do that less and less. And this was especially apparent in French when I would teach this uh, one man, uh, his name was uh, Jean. Uh, I learned that I would have a lot more French memorized and the fluidity with French came a lot quicker. It's actually been proven that uh, the more you tutor, the actually better you get on the subject you're doing. And I think it's really important because it's also a place for people to meet and for culture to flourish. I was actually offered a job from one of the people who was uh, tutoring there and they said they really needed help with uh, talking to clients in English. And I did help them and I, I didn't take payment for it, but I think it's important that this person was able to find somebody in a, in a place like this that not only teaches something, but it also it fosters a community that would not be there otherwise. Um, it's also very cool to see how my students progress and the things I can teach them were oftentimes beyond just the language. One of the most impactful moments for me while working at, um, while working at uh, Building One Community was a time where I spent my two hour period instead of uh, teaching a woman that much English I helped a very kind lady. I helped her learn how to read a analog clock. And I think this was a very impactful moment to me because I realized the amount of exposure uh, to different cultures and different situations that other people have. This is a woman who it's very possible has never seen an analog clock before, before coming to the United States. And I think to me, it was very impactful that I could make such a big change in this woman's life because she told me how useful it was in her job to be able to read an analog clock because she worked as a cleaning lady and when she would have to finish her job, she wasn't exactly sure when she was supposed to leave because the house she would work in had just an analog clock in it. And I think to me, it was so impactful that I was not only making a a uh, lingual impression on these people, I was also making a cultural impression on these people. And to me, that was, that was very important and that was very rewarding. I have with me one of the youth group leaders and he is going to explain to us a little bit about the uh, mission statement of Building One Community and more or less how it works and what they do. Uh, this is Matteo. My name is Matteo Gigliani. I am a youth leader at Building One Community, specifically B1C's youth group ESL, or English as a Second Language classes. 
Here at B1C, our mission is to advance the successful integration of local immigrants into American society. Uh, B1C functions as the Central Immigration Services Center in and around Stanford, and we offer a number of services, including ESL classes, sometimes headed by the youth group, but other times run throughout the week. We also offer citizenship test classes, literacy classes, uh, legal services, as well as we connect immigrants to local job opportunities so that they can better integrate into society. Thank you very much, Mateo. Uh, thank you for joining us today. I really appreciate it.